What's going on, you guys? I'm going to go ahead and show you how to beat Yorm the Giant, um, just in case anyone was wondering. I didn't have any live commentary on this fight, so I figured I might as well talk about the boss and the weapon you have to use on this boss. You can't just use any old weapon because you will quickly see that it does nothing to this boss. It barely even touches it. And you're going to see that the, the health on this thing is ridiculous. So when you're in the fight, you will see that there's a weapon right at the stairs. You won't see it right now because obviously this is like my fourth attempt. But when you first get there, you'll see it. Pick it up. Equip it if you can. But if you can't, no worries. I mean, there's no shame in dying. That's what happened to me. Um, I didn't even know to pick up the weapon. So the first time I was just trying to hit him with what I had and it was doing nothing. So I died. Um, second time, I did pick up the weapon. Died again. Uh, the third time, I didn't know how to use the weapon properly. So here I am the fourth try. And I practiced a little bit beforehand just to make sure I got it down. So I'm going to teach you guys how to do that. The weapon... If, in case I haven't mentioned it yet, it's called the Storm Ruler. So you want to equip that. What you're going to do is you're going to two-hand the weapon and then you're going to charge it. So to charge it, you have to hold down left trigger. And you will see that it only takes a couple seconds. You have it fully charged. And then once you have that charge, you're going to hold L2, then press R1, the right bumper. And that will do crazy damage to this boss. You can see in this fight, I'm a little bit sloppy with it. I was trying to get in good position. I was being a little bit greedy too, um, and he was taking advantage of that. So you just want to get some distance on him. Make sure you're not about to get hit or anything. Roll away, get some distance, and then you can get the hits down. It takes about, I don't know, three or four hits. It's really not that much. And it's pretty easy once you get this down. Um, this boss, I kind of was a little bit disappointed with it. I, I love the weapon. I love the Storm Ruler. I think it's cool. And uh, I love that it does so much damage. But I kind of wish the weapon would have dropped down maybe later in the fight. Like maybe I could have just went at it for a while and tried to do what I could do with my own weapon. And then maybe he would go into like a second phase and then that weapon would become available. Something like that I think would have been better. Um, but nonetheless, I did like the boss. I thought it was cool. Um, the weapon's cool. But yeah, I hope this video helped you guys. I know I, I did some research, I looked around, and some people make videos on this boss, but they don't really go into description about it. They, they just kind of say, just use the weapon. You're good. <laughs> and that's it. So I wanted to be more descriptive and kind of give you guys something to help you out. So I hope you enjoyed. Also, you guys, I forgot to mention that this weapon and the move that you're using with this weapon does use your magic bar, your blue bar. But don't worry, if you do run out of magic, it'll still work. So no worries about that. Do what you gotta do. Thanks again for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace.